Hey guys, welcome to our channel. So we've been decoding man witch, changing to man witch. Um, we got our extraction or uh, residue as evidence for the change. Got our extractions to run through all the categories found in the University of New Mexico. Uh, converted that those extractions into numerology numbers using a numerology chart. Ran that through the categories. Connected the University of New Mexico to man witch, man witch with gematria, and then connected that or those to the rest of the changes for, for a total of 15 changes, connected them to the other 14 for a total of 15 changes. Um, we then ran that through, we converted that into a simple binary and ran that through the categories, found some pretty interesting stuff. And now we're on the alphabetic order. Um, we've got that alphabetic order to run through the stock market, finance, uh, genetics, medical, and now we're on chemical. So, um, your extractions, all that happened was an M change due an N, and we converted that to 1314 uh, using this. M is 13, N is 14. Whoops. So uh, 1314. Now we're on chemical. So start with 13. You have group 13, chemical reactivity. Group 13, boron family. Chemical Libre texts, carbon 13, chemical shifts, and intramolecular hydrogen. And 13 CNMR. Oh, look. Here's NM, MN. Chemical shifts. Um, and you got a bunch more stuff on carbon 13 here. Nature and biology, I don't see 13 there. Real-time prediction of 1H and 13C chemical shifts. So there's more of that chemical shifts. The growing importance of computational chemical shift prediction. <coughs> so <coughs> if you move on from that, um, you've got 131. How about toxic chemical release forms? 49-131, right here. And I don't think we have to get into that. But you've also got uh, Chem 131, Lakeland.edu, Chemical Principles, Chem 131, BulletinCapital.edu. So you got some classes here. Um, Chem 131. Um, quite a few of those. And Chem 131, Durham Technical or Community College. And that's what I was going to show you before that you had, but we'd already got this. You had that iodine-131. We had that in medical. <laughs> iodine-131 is a radioactive isotope of iodine with an atomic mass of 131. A half-life of eight days and a potential anti-neoplastic activity. So there's your iodine-131 again. Uh, move on from that. You got 314. You got uh, 314 Chemical Engineering Computing, Lafayette College. Uh, QX-134 chlor Chloride. Cayman Chemical Company supplies scientists worldwide with resources necessary. Uh, dot, dot, dot. But anyway, uh, QX-314 is a membrane impermeant idiocane derivative yeah is it gonna tell me that selectively blocks sodium channels on non in non not not neurons when delivered intracellularly via the TRPV1 channel. 
but is reportedly ineffective with extracellular application. So, you got that. You got some classes here, some colleges they could hit. Um, Ancel Chemtech 38 314. Um, so, this is a QX 314. If I said one or uh, 131, I didn't mean to. <coughs> um, you got 314 floor and carpet neutralizer. So there's a chemical product, um, chemical engineering and computing, OECD guidelines for testing of chemicals, section three. And here is your one or three, or excuse me, 314D, biodegradation in treated effluent surface water mixing zone test 18. So you got a few things going on there. And we're going to move on to the whole thing going forward, 1314. You have UN slash NA 1314 Cameo Chemicals. Flammable solid. Cameo Chemicals has one chemical data sheet with response recommendations for this number. So you got a chemical data sheet. Uh 21 CFR Part 1314, Retail Sale of Scheduled Listed Chemical Products. You got Strem Chemical Incorporated, CAS number 1314-34-7. Um, vanadium, 3 oxide, 95%. We are going to do uh, um, atomic numbers and see what's going on with those. Uh, there's that again. You also have 1314-23-4 uh, zirconium, zirconium oxide spectrum chemical. So... Uh, content, content details, part 1314, gov.info, food and drugs, chapter 2, Drug Enforcement Administration, Department of Justice, part 1314, retail sale of scheduled listed chemical products, strontium oxide, 1314-11-0, Lower Ad Chemical Corporation, <coughs> so... You got a few things going on with the whole thing coming forward. Now that gets you through going forward. Now we're going to come back and start with 41. Um, looks like uh, periodic table ni niobium. And we'll get into that with the atomic numbers, I'm sure. But other than that, you got C41, uh, processing chemicals, Fuji film. Um. Sign kind still CS41 color simplified two bath kit C41 chemistry right here chemical composition of AISI Rene 41 nickel alloys so nickel alloys here. And uh, basic blue 41 on PubChem. Structure, chemical names, and physical chemical properties, classifications, patents, literature. So basic blue 41. I wonder what that is. I wonder if I can find out what that is at all. Laboratory Chemical Safety Data Sheet. We've had those before. Eh, not really, but that's okay. Basically, there's a few things here. BDE-41, Chemical Details, Environmental Protection Agency. 
So we've got a, quite a few things I'm sure we could go on. JP3-41, chemical, biological, radiological, and nuclear response. September 9th, 2016. Huh. Ninth, twenty sixteen. Let's see if anything pops up. Yeah. Not really seeing anything significant right off hand. War in Afghanistan. Not really seeing anything significant there, but that's okay. Figured we'd check it out. Um, but if you move on from that, anyway, you got 413. And 413, how about... Uh, CHE413, Chemical Process Safety. <clears throat> this is Chemical Engineering at Old Miss.edu. Um, chemical Engineering Journal, Volume 413. So anything in there. Chemical Engineering Laboratory 3. Holman.edu. Chemical Engineering Lab, Howard University. Series 46H-413, high build uh, Tanima Tar, uh, Tanima Company Incorporated. So, 413 Chemical Engineering Equipment Design. So, it's a course. So, another thing they can hit there. And if you move on from that, you got the whole thing coming back. 4131. America SAE J404-4131. Another data sheet, chemical data sheet. How about Gripper 4131 KO Chemicals Global? There's your global. Um, Dodge Dodge. Dotagen 4131 by Clariant. UL Prospector is a catatonic, cationic surfacent for the chemical technology industry. Colorless and slightly, colorless to slightly yellow liquid is composed of something that I'm not even going to try to pronounce right now. Blozna 4131 high performance barrier coating. There's your gripper one or 4131 again. Uh dimethyl 33 huh, 33 uh thiodipropanate 4131 TCI America, products, chemistry, materials, science, life science, analytical chemistry, chemicals by class. Um, you got high temp fluoropolymer hose. That's chemical resistant, 4131. And that gets you through going forwards and backwards. And chemicals. And we will do atomic numbers next, um, followed by artificial intelligence. So <clears throat> there's your chemicals in the alphabetic or uh, the alphabetic order numbers, right? So that's going to be it for this one. Pretty self explanatory. Plenty of stuff in there. There's even more stuff in there than I, than I went through, but I'm not going to spend the whole day going through it. Um, and so anyway, uh, for now, guys, thanks for all your thumbs up, thumbs down when appropriate. Thanks for your comments, leads, feedback, and subscriptions. 
And uh, thanks for watching, guys. And for now, you guys have a great rest of your day.